What's good greatness gang welcome back to another reaction and today I have a very special reaction for you all from a tribute band to Rush yes I said a tribute band I just found out that Rush has his own tribute bands and they play a lot of Rush's music so the name of the band is Mood Lifters okay so I recently came across this band and I've seen that they're doing a lot of Rush songs and I was like, hey, I need to listen to that with the Greatness Gang community because you all put me on to Rush and I like their music a lot. So uh, I know that Rush is a very talented, skilled band. So if you're going to be a tribute band to Rush, you have to have skills as well. So that's what made me excited to react to these people. Uh, their website is moodliftersrush.com and I was reading a little bit about the band uh, it said they are based in Southern California and they officially launched in late 2021 but uh, it said they've been doing tributes to Rush uh, with other bands as well before they all came together so the members are uh, probably going to pronounce their names wrong but Rocky Cunner, Cooner, uh, she's the vocalist. Isamu Kakitani, bass guitar, keyboard, pedals. Ben King, guitar, and Matt Miranda, drums and percussion. So, the song that I'm going to be reacting to is Bastille Day. Uh, so, I'm going to react to not only the tribute band's mood lifter version but I'm also going to react to Rush's version as well so I can also get a feel of how well mood lifters did so I'm going to listen to Rush's live version from 1976 Capitol Theater first and then we're going to get into mood lifters so we can compare the two Would you please welcome from Canada Rush Once again, once you get comfortable with the part in the song, Rush is like, uh-uh, we're taking it back. I like how he got the scarf hanging out of his shirt. Oh, wait a minute. Uh, boots. Can you see that? Those are some heels they're wearing. And they're moving around in them. Oh yeah. You got Alex with the longer hair.
like about Getty's voice? You don't expect him to sound like that once he starts singing. Like, at all. And it's like, when you hear it, it's not the traditional rock star lead vocalist voice. So once you hear it, you just like, wait a minute, what is this? And as you like, take some time to listen, and it's like, it's him. Like, it's who he is. And you then is able to listen to the song with less judgment. Listen to it as a whole, if that makes any sense. Hear the echoes of the centuries well. Power is in all the money boy. Wow! I love the back and forth. Okay, so that was the original version of A Still Day. Uh, so we're going to get into the Mood Lifters tribute version. Uh, before I start, I just want to say I'm very eager to mainly see how the lead vocalist does because I was saying how Getty's voice is so unique. So I really want to see how she delivers. One thing I noticed, I noticed that she's not playing the guitar and singing like Getty. my 
nice with the solo. That was Mood Lifters, a tribute to Rush, but still they live. Uh, I like that a lot. Uh, let me just talk about the song overall. Uh, musically, and just like the overall feel of the song. I feel like that was like the most simple Rush song that I've listened to f so far. And uh, I mean that in a good way, because I know how. Rush can have a lot going on in their song. And I didn't realize I was able to steadily move my body more with that song, really feel the instruments more with that song. Um, I love the guitar parts uh, on that song, the, the electric guitar parts a lot. Uh, as far as mood lifters, overall, they did a really good job to be able to cover a, a great, skillful, complex band like Rush. Like that says a lot uh, on their part. Uh, the lead vocalist, let me get the uh, young lady's name one more time. Uh, Rocky, <clears throat> she did a very good job to be able to not only imitate, but still be able to just deliver overall the complexity of Getty's voice and vocals of that song so I need to uh, I need to hear her sing a non-rush song so I can get a feel of her her uh, voice uh, vo voices versatility is what I'm trying to say but uh, Moo Lifters I can tell these guys are very good I will, I'm going to listen to more of them uh, thank you for watching this video. Let me know what you want to hear next. Love you guys.